I mean it. This is my last video of the week. Oh, yuck, oh, yuck, oh, yuck. Check this out. Look at this. We have a, a deck of cards, a deck of cards that's mixed, and uh, we get the uh, the four aces. Look at that. <laughs> Baby! Now, this is the sort of thing you want to use as a lead-in. Anytime you want to make the four aces appear, or anytime you have to do something that requires the aces, you could do this as a lead-in and look like, well, a fur... Jin. Check out the Pig Cake Magic Academy, the home of over 1,500 videos going over card stuff, coin stuff, everything you need to become the best magician you could possibly be. If you're not a member, you're missing out. It's less than the price of a White Claw a month, and you get access to many, many videos going over everything you potentially need to become the best magician you could possibly be. So what's great about this is that it takes advantage of your naturally clammy hands as a magician and a person with hyperhidrosis, and uh, all you need is a setup. So you place one ace face up on the bottom and then you're going to place one ace face up third from the top the next ace is face down on top now the first move that you need to accomplish here is this right here which seems like a very complicated action but it's actually not it's a friction toss control you're going to hold the cards in your right hand you're going to pressure with your thumb on top and your fingers on the bottom and you're going to toss the deck to the other hand now because of the friction of your thumb on top and your fingers on the bottom what's going to happen is that the two cards on top and bottom are going to stay in your right hand all i'm doing is tossing the rest of the deck to my hand try this with a deck of cards in your hand and you're going to see that you're pretty much going to get this right off the bat this is in beginner magic moves if you can't do this then you probably have hope now here's the thing, if you squeeze on these two cards with your thumb and forefinger still pressing, what's going to happen is that your fingers are actually going to adhere to the playing cards, which is going to be necessary for the second part of the production, where you separate both hands like this, and you get the uh, apparition of both of these aces. So you're just pressing down with your thumb and your finger on the bottom, and you're going to see that that card is actually going to adhere without any need for adhesive on the actual card itself. Now here's where it gets complicated because with the other hand, this is what you're doing. You're going to use your thumb to lever this card up and around over the upper left corner. So you're just going to put pressure over your thumb, you're going to revolve it just like this, and it's going to go up and around and behind the deck. This is all taking place at the same time and you get this nice boom pop apparition of the four aces. And when you combine both of those actions, you get this. Look at that. You get a nice, crazy, instantaneous apparition of the four aces, and you could use that to have sex. Isn't that fun? Isn't that exciting? I'm sure you could use that somewhere. Uh, some advice at the end of the video. I recently bought this from Timu.com. It's a, a leather uh, strop for sharpening. I want to see if it actually works as well as uh, it's supposed to. I also got it along with this. And what's great about Timu is that because it's coming from the hands of adolescent Chinese uh, boys, um, you get things that are usually uh, hundreds of dollars for like uh, two bucks. This right here. Look at this. Bam! This is a, a dupe of the Victorinox Champ. Now, this is a DXL. The XL would probably go up to here, but this is still the Champ. And uh, I've tested most of the uh, actual things inside of this and for five to six bucks this is a really good dupe you have uh, some good pliers here you have a, a fish scaler look at this you have a whole plier here now obviously you're not going to use this for heavy duty stuff but for doing things that you might need to use a little a little more nuance you could definitely use that uh, it has a lot of features here it has uh, certain things it even has the corkscrew with this little eyeglass screwdriver inside look at that all that for six bucks? Now, I'm sure you're not going to get Victorinox quality, but I just tried the knife and it's very sharp. Very, very sharp. So, uh, I don't know. I'm not uh, opposed to selling my information to the Asians for heavy discounts on, uh, on products. I think you might be. I see you again When 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 I see you again Oh,